So we started with this metal chalkboard from Hobby Lobby for $1.99. And we took one of our Studio R12 stencils and we laid it on top of the chalkboard. Taking some blue painter's tape, we just secured the stencil in place. I covered the lemons in the open daily because I did not want that stenciled on yet. Using some Snow Owl from Wise Owl Paint and a foam dabber, I put a very small amount of paint on my dabber and I just went over the Lemon Farm Fresh and Sweet. And then I removed the stencil. I grabbed this wooden truck from Dollar General for $2.00. And I started by staining it with some General Finishes gel stain. And you just use a foam brush and then wipe it off with a paper towel. I painted the back of the truck using Golden Rod from Wise Owl because I was not sure if it was going to be exposed. And I took these artificial lemon plants that I got from Michaels for 50% off. And I just cut the lemons off of the bundle. And I just started to glue them to cover up the Easter eggs. You can layer it by starting with some of the artificial leaves and laying those down and then placing the lemons on top. It's something you may just have to mess around with until you have the back of the truck filled. And once that was done, I took a popsicle stick and I measured it to the length of the back of the truck and I cut it using my metal shears. I covered it with some gel stain, and then I just glued it in place so that it just covered the ends of the artificial plant. And then using some E6000, I, and a little bit of hot glue, I attached the truck to the bottom of the chalkboard. I went back to my stencil and I used the foam dabber and some more snow owl to stencil the open daily to the side of the truck door. And there you go, now you have this lemon farm sign. And you can transform these wooden trucks with anything that you want. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Other tutorials can be found over on our YouTube channel and paint products over on chalkitupfancy.com. Have a great day.